Hey folks, welcome back to Horse Pen Ranch and the Horse Pen Ranch YouTube channel. We gave you a tour of the wagon before. This time we're gonna give you a tour of what we haul this wagon in when we go down the highway. So stay tuned. That right there is a new herd bull I'm, I'm, I'm raising. I haven't named him yet. He's half Charlay and half Angus. And this guy right here will be a future on videos. He's a steer that we're gonna eat before long. Let me show you this trailer. This is it right here. It is a uh, 20 foot enclosed trailer, as wide as they can come. And so we just got this earlier this year, 2022. And so, Normally, I have in the past uh, pulled my wagon on a um, flatbed trailer, open trailer, and it's great and all because people can see the wagon going down the road and they'll give you a honk and a wave. It's you know it's cool to see an old chuck wagon from the 1800s on the highway, but it's also the whole time you're driving down the road, you're thinking, man, hope something don't fly off some vehicle and hit my wagon, or hope something doesn't happen. Okay, so it's safer in here. It's safer in here, and I can leave it in here more often. Let me show you this here. I'm just gonna give you a quick tour. This is gonna be a short video, but uh, here we go. This was just a, a simple, empty box trailer, and we have added some stuff to it. A nice little handy ramp that opens up like so. So I painted the floor in it. Come on over here and I'll show you there's no wagon in it right now, but I'll kind of show you kind of how we got it set up. The wagon fits in here like a glove. All right, number one. Uh, so we have a winch at the very, very front, 4,500 pound winch that I have hooked to my battery in my truck. I have a connector and that's how we pull the wagon up here. It's very heavy. And so right now I have these just two by twos. I'm probably gonna change that out for something probably uh, metal. I'm not really sure yet, but it's, it's working fine for now. It kind of keeps the wagon wheels in a, uh, in a rut, so that helps out quite a bit. Come on up here. My beautiful wife's the camera lady today, and so she's going to be running the camera. So um, the wagon runs right here. Let me open this door give us some more light. Okay, so it runs. It fits right here. The barrel hugs this wall right here. barrel stops about right here on the side of the wagon. So we got a wash tub here. Right here is our um, firebox, our new firebox. You saw in our, our latest videos at the uh, Chisholm Trail Museum. We have it on legs if we want it on legs. So that's our new forged firebox. Got a spare tire on this side. This is for our cook fly, our poles for our cook fly and flag pole. Sitting here, got a big skillet right here hanging. This is a fresh water I use this for, if, for clean water if I don't have a water hose available. Uh, tabletop right here sits underneath the wagon. Also, we got the wagon tongue right here, sitting here. And come on in here, camera lady. I got my propane tanks right here. Use one to start a fire. Use one to run a gas stove if I need to. They're just good to have here. Um, so this wagon stops about right here right here and so i have this space right here for our stuff that we haul uh right here is our wagon bows we don't of course we can't leave them on the wagon while it's in here and so our wagon bows sit here this is a table that we use when we do dishes and stuff kind of put it in the back of the camp it's a plastic table we kind of use that to to do our dishes on um come back in here let me show you oh this tote right here sets on top of this gang box and that is all our canvas so that's the wagon sheet and that is the cook fly the big cook fly that we set up okay come on over here let me show you this system okay okay so this is our tote system i was going to put shelves in here we already had these totes and my son's like dad just stacked a tote so we did we stacked the tote so we, and my, my daughter helped me label them so you can kind of see what we have in here we don't always use all this stuff but here they are spices and coffee and plates and antiques for the wagon and Ziploc, you guys see it, cooking utensils. This is the groceries I take on each um, 
this one that will interchange because different gushers that we use on different events. Wash tub that goes on that table and our cleaner. Full pans, phone cups, baking pans. That's the inserts that we use sometimes in our Dutch ovens. Paper goods at the very bottom. Of course, you always got to have some, some hard lump charcoal just in case. And uh, I haven't did a video with my uh, cowboy walk, if you will, uh, discata. I'll do one with that. They're, they're fun to cook on uh, down the road here. But this right here is where we keep our Dutch ovens. So check this out. I made a little, we had this on our, actually on our 18 foot uh, flatbed, but 14 inches here and two stacks of 12 inches here go here. And so, and then over here, I got a couple big skillets, the grills for my uh, firebox, 10 inch down there, Dutch oven. Got a 20 inch uh, skillet, I think a 16 inch skillet. So there you go. There's there's our barrel tops that we uh, like to uh, cook on. And then there's my winch right there, guys. And that's kind of it. I mean, this is it right here. We got our toast where they can't go anywhere. As you can see, they get, they're nice and solid. And we put an ice chest usually right here where we walk in. We put an ice chest right here full of goods. We got extra another table if we need to bring it, we'll bring it. But this is our new trailer that we haul the wagon in. Of course, you cannot, uh, we go miles, we go different states, we go far away sometimes, so you can't necessarily pull it with a, um, a team of horses or mules. It, it can be done that way, but, but it's really far. So we don't do it that way in 2022. So thank you so much for watching Horsepin Ranch. Uh, this is it. This is how we do it. It's as simple, but I wanted to kind of show you some behind the scenes stuff. And uh, hey, until next time, we'll see you on Horsepin Ranch.